Well, it's pretty funny that you saved that top of your... I was going to get a new handle. <laughs> it looks pretty stuck. I don't think it's going anywhere. It's not moving? No. No, not really. It's, it's stuck in there now, I think. Well, I was just thinking we could stick it across the fire and let it burn in the middle. Oh, well. And then as it, that's my red as it breaks, then we pick up that piece. I was kind of thinking that, too, to right. be honest. That's how I do it. <laughs> I mean, if we start burning it now, <laughs> and then we can move it. Winston, I say let's jump on it, except I don't want anybody breaking themselves. Oh, Winston, are you helping the boys? How nice. Yeah. Those receipts always get. Yeah, and Stacy's good for carrying the fire starters. She had like so many for my meetup. It was I'm hoping it catches. It was great. Down at the bottom. Oh yeah, it's right on top, so it should be fine. Stacy, we're ready to start the fire. Yeah, we're scream <laughs> we're screaming at you. Sorry. Yeah, and then I was like, oh crap, I forgot she had some stuff to work. <laughs> Oh, it's catching. Yeah. It's catching. Okay. Yeah, Stay over here, kid. Ooh, it's chilly, huh? gonna be cold tonight right now in the van it is 59 degrees it's about 6 15 and I'm going to turn on my heater a little bit and we'll see I know you're cold we have the heating blanket on we're gonna turn on the heater and see uh, how it does Ooh, just turn it on feeling good it didn't spew any flames or anything at us, so that's good. So just turn it on. I know it's going to get warmed up in here. We'll see how long it takes us to warm up a little bit, okay? I know you're cold. It is chilly. Oh, that feels so good. I'm already so happy I got this for us, Bubba. Alrighty, I ran the heater for 10 minutes, and it raised the temperature by about six degrees. So it is nice and toasty in here now. Winston is cozy. I just turned it off. And like I said in the video when I started talking about it is I like that the heater does not touch anything because it has legs and a stand, which makes it awesome. So I can just keep it on this bamboo table and I can even just move the table, even though the table is uh, folded in half right now. I can kind of just like move the table with the heater on it if I want to, but that's a great spot for it. Currently it's cooling down, but yeah, it's nice and toasty in here now. The temperature is actually continuing to rise, so we are comfortable. It rained last night, which was awesome. I think the rain is finally done for the day and we will have a clear week, but it is cold. I just put our heater on. Oh my gosh. I am so thankful for this thing right now. It's about 11 o'clock. It's 45 degrees. And this is not typical for February 10th in Arizona. It is not normal. I'm not liking it. <laughs> Normally it's like 70 to 75 and sunny on February 10th every year, but I guess not so much. So instead we have the heater and we're going to snuggle never a bad thing though to have a day of rest i have to say if you don't believe in climate change like you need to get over it because that shit is here y'all it's february 10th it's like 48 degrees out it's windy it's cold it's been raining a lot and we're in arizona i've been in the state for 25 years 20 years ago at this time of the year in arizona the birds were singing, 75 degrees, sunny, warm, beautiful, flowers are blooming.
fast forward and we have a real winter now. It's terrible. It's terrible. Ugh, it's very icky. I don't like it one bit. It's windy, but at least the sun is peeking out. We're all trying to make the most of today, despite the fact that it's cold. I really need to get a shower in. I don't want to because it's cold, but I'm going to anyways. <laughs> I'll just heat up my water and it'll be fine. When the sun really comes out and the wind dies down a bit, it's nice out. But at least we have 70s and sunny forecasted the rest of the week. I'm getting my solar uh, or my solar's plugged in. I'm getting my power stations all charged up. I finally did my dishes after my cooking this morning. It was fun to go live to make breakfast burritos. I'm really, I really want to go live like once a week. I'm not good about it because it gives me anxiety, but I need to do it. So, got my van cleaned up. I parked my van this way because I knew that I would get a good wind block, and I am. It's actually a lot warmer on this side of my van, so that's why I have Winston's playpen set up, and it is good and toasty inside the van. What are you doing? So this is Kim's really badass forerunner, and she has this tent that's super awesome. Maddie on his channel, Maddie Van Halen, is going to be talking about it in a video, so be sure to check that out because it's just really, really neat. Uh, she's not full-time, but she is uh, traveling with a dog, so be sure to look at his channel so you can see her setup. There's Stacy and Justin. Oh, Maddie, Maddie actually got out his chair. I took a shower despite the wind and the cold. <laughs> but I take a shower every other day. I have to wash my hair. I can't not wash my hair. It's just a thing. Luckily, it was nice and cold, in, or cold, warm inside the tent, and I boiled my water. So it wasn't too bad. It was just the like getting out part that was slightly miserable. Um, mo I think all of us have retreated to our vans right now. It's only about four o'clock, but it's just cold. <laughs> it's just cold. And we all needed a break. So I brought Winston into the van and I turned on our butane heater. It got up to 65 in here. So it's nice and toasty. I just plugged in my hot logic so I can heat up a home chef meal. So that'll be ready in about an hour. And then I'm about to feed Winston as well. So while my hair just kind of dries, um, I'm going to watch some shows. We're going to hang out. Tomorrow will be much nicer. Today it was about 52 with about 10 miles per hour winds. And tomorrow it's supposed to be 58 and sunny with only the wind will be, it'll just be a slight breeze, I think like five miles per hour. So and it will continue to get better after that. We are headed out on Monday. Maddie is headed out early for appointments. I am headed out whenever I get up and get going. And our plans have changed. We were going to go check out a new spot in Yuma or near Yuma. But turns out there's a big event happening there. And we don't want to be around the big crowds of people. And I heard there's a lot of loose dogs at that event. So I'm going to steer clear because the area is not going anywhere so we will go check it out when it's uh, quieter and safer uh, for everybody so but in the meantime tomorrow will be good just hanging out with the group and doing our desert thing I've gotten so many questions about my new butane heater heater and I will link it in the comment section of this video I purchased it on Amazon. I made a video about it the other day when I unboxed it, but it runs on butane canisters. I wanted to use, I wanted to get a butane heater instead of propane. That way I only have to carry butane on me because I use 
my mini gas one butane stove so i didn't want to have to carry butane and propane but it has uh, different settings i only leave it on for 10 minutes at a time or so because it heats up my entire van one canister will last you about four hours it has a handle it doesn't get hot the stand it doesn't get hot either and it also has legs so it's not sitting directly on anything which is nice but i would recommend going um clicking on that amazon link and taking a look at all of the specs so you can find out more but i am loving it <laughs> it's it heats up the entire van so and it, it doesn't have to be like right on you so it is very very awesome be sure to check it out but right now i would recommend it i haven't used it for long but it's been great winston is cozy in his little cocoon i just offered him dinner but he's had a lot of snacks today so i think he uh it'll be a little bit before he eats in any event, we will wrap up this video for today. Thanks to everyone who tuned in to my live earlier, and we will probably catch you guys tomorrow. Thanks so much. Like and subscribe. I will see you next time.